The reason we're so proud today is that this is an important step uh, within the realization of our uh, Plan de Santé, our health plan. Two years ago, when we, uh, when we made the plan clear, we said that we would work on the foundation of the health system, and, uh, but that we would have uh, priorities, eight priorities, to make sure that we start uh, the changes that the Quebecers deserve. Um, when we did uh, this uh, Projet Loi, PL15, we said clearly that uh, we needed to have a new governance, and that new governance was in one of the things that uh, we would need a CEO that would uh, coordinate the work within our 35 PDG, because it's, it's, it's a lot of work to work with those people and make sure that we have access to best practices. What happened in the last few weeks when we were interviewing the uh, potentials of uh, the CEOs and potentials of other people in, uh, in, the, in the, those roles, we had the opportunity to say, well, why don't we accelerate those decisions and not only uh, name the CEO, but um, name that person that is today Monsieur Abergel, the CEO, the chief operating officer, as in many large organizations when uh, the CEO delegate the operation and to concentrate more on strategic issues like HR uh, and uh, all those other issues, finance strategy and uh, customer service to say the least. So I think today the chance that we have is we have, we're exactly where we were wanted to be after two years of the health plan and we still have the horizon of 2025 to make sure that the changes that we made will be taken from this group and uh, push forward to make sure that we improve the network. So this is, we are exactly where we want to be, and today is a very key step on that. Well, I, I think when we choose, um, and I've been uh, lucky enough to have, during my career, the chance to choose uh, some managers, and I think you look into many things in one leader. You just don't look at one thing. In this case here, we need uh, some expertise, for sure. And that's the reason I think that was almost a bonus that she was familiar with the health system. Not in the same way as Frédéric is, but she knows about you know, uh, the system. She knows about, and she knew this gentleman. So she has been in contact with the health system. So we know it takes a lot of credibility when you arrive as a, as a CEO, as a president, and that credibility comes some, sometimes from the sector. I think the quality that we were looking for is leadership. And I think that the people that have been dealing with Madame Biron when she has been CEO for 15 years, not a couple of years, but 15 years, and she has increased the value of that, of that group, I think the leadership is the other thing. Now, I think the third quality is how to manage people. And I think we have, you know, some issues with our people. They want to have a better environment to work. And I think that within the people that she will be able to bring with her in that small team will be a very strong HR person to make sure that we have a plan with our nurses, with our preposé, with our doctors. Where do we see the professionals in our system to make sure that we work together? So I would say those are the three qualities that we were looking. And as a bonus, we have them in that same person. And she's here today and willing to work with somebody that knows the network. So that's the reason I'm very proud of what we're presenting to Quebecers today.